will always love you. And I'll always be a bodyguard. We're on the downtown Ketter Path was promenade and the harbour area. There's a spectacality of a view, that's for sure. There's a little bit of moonlight up there, and of course that's glistening across the blue, 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 blue Mediterranean Sea, and it's making the sky look simply spectacular. Looks like a bit of a lightning storm, but it's not. It's the flickering of that sunshine as it starts on its descent off to downtown Cato, Australia. Now, I've brought with me, quite simply, the most beautiful woman in the world, and of course her name is Miss Archie, we'll sit behind the booth. Hello, everybody. How nice, beautiful, amazing, wonderful, terrific to see you again and again. What else I know uh, in this line? Beautiful, wonderful, terrific, amazing, amazing spectacular. Spe spectacular is a bit different. Anyway, spectacality. To see it's a you word again. that doesn't even exist yet. And again. And again. You're talking to yourself, and I'm talking Probably. to my. Probably. I often do. Completely off my rocker. Now, can I ask you? What's in that little bag? You've got a little bag on your wrist. What's in that bag? This is our little, not very little, our Megan. This is for our Megan. This is for Princess Megan. We, That's a superstar. Show the present of yes, the let's have a quick look at it. This is especially for her. I mean, there's the little bag, for especially for her. We go out of our way to try and find uh, these little sweet things, and we found that one. I bought. And what have we got? Actually, look at that. we bought this nice this little watch with watch. a wrap round leatherette. Uh, wow. She's gonna like that. She's gonna like that. She's gonna I think like, you like it. that. It, you know, at the end of the day, it's the, more the memory. It's more the thought. Yes, correct word. It is Mr. indeed. Julian, yeah. you see, I'm getting clever and clever with the helping of yours. And I only hope that time to time she look at this and say, "Oh my God, this is from my friend." And present for Max, your brother. Coming very it's soon. coming very, very Just soon indeed. It. it is. These are some superstars that have accosted us once or twice, and we now consider them to be great, great friends indeed. Mr. Simon, Miss Jessica, of course, Prince S, Megan, and of course, the superstar, the little gangster boy that we call Gangster Max. And he's a star, that is for sure. They were monkeying around on the Ocean Vision, and they had the times of their lives, and they said that that boat trip was absolutely spectacular. We're on the downtown Cater Pathos Promenade and uh, there's one or two street traders around. This guy over here, he's chatting to two people now. He's probably the greatest caricature artist in the world and certainly one of the best on the downtown Cater Pathos Promenade. On that note, if you go and click through to our Buy Me A Coffee platform, so Google that, Buy Me A Coffee, Marika and me, and up it will come, tell you a little bit about us, and it will show you that sketch that he did. And he even made me look quite good as well. I mean, Graciela Booth is obviously way, way beyond beautiful, so he had a very, very easy job indeed. His name is Mr Hector, and here's a bit of a twist to the way he does it, by the way. He tends to take a couple of pictures of you and then spares his time and lets you go and then he sketches that through the day or through the night and you come back the following day. How it shows around 20 euros if you want a great great artist impression that ranges from 80 euros and up. Now, there is one gentleman on the downtown Cater Pathos promenade and harbour area that doesn't need much of an introduction at all. He is possibly, well probably, the most famous man in the world. His name is Mr Chris. Good evening. How That's for Gumbaro, you alright? Yeah, for Gumbaro, of course I'm. Uh, have you had a good day? Very good day, yeah. Because you wouldn't lie, would you? No, I wouldn't no, lie. Because I was here day. for yeah. a couple of hours, we and I know you took a few. To Mr. It? Richard and everything. Yeah, we did. Himself. Mr. Richard came along. So? We met a few guys. You had a cigar. Yeah. I got a coffee. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I haven't worked out who's getting the best deal yet, whether it's me or you. I think it's you. Oh, and where's my commission? Excellent. End of, the of the month has come. End of the month, really. It's come. <laughs> the end of the month came. And next month. Well, next month. There we are. You well, see? <laughs> what a clever, clever man he is. That's why he's got a lot, lot more money than me and you. Mediterranean sea sponges. That's what he's on about. Look at that. If you want a little one, if perhaps you are a little E, or perhaps you want to exfoliate, these are the ones for you. Then they ramp up in size. Five euros, perhaps, to do a bit of showering with. Twelve euros if you want to do a bathing. And if you want to have a bit of, well, a bit of a fight and throw one at someone, or perhaps make your own giant whopper. Get yourself a bread roll, some lettuce, tomato, and cucumber, and a little bit of sauce. And I'm telling you, that could be the whopper sponge for you, ranging from 18 to 30 euros. Most popular sponges are these ones. 
They're a nice size. They're nice and fluffy and lovely. And they really are nice on Miss Andrea's face and, of course, even on Mr. Mark's peacock. And if you buy one of these lot over here, ranging from €12 Euros up, guess what? You get one of them totally free of charge. In fact, can I get one tonight? Yeah. There we are. Yeah. Lovely. I always like to get something free, as everyone knows. There we are. Yasu yes, Gumbaro, thanks yes, very much. Gumbaro, thank you. I'll see you around about 12 o'clock. Okay. You get the coffee. Yeah. I'll bring the cigars. Definitely. And we'll chat with the policeman and the mayor and all these kind of people and sell a couple of sponges along the way. Of course, of course. <laughs> That's what we're going to do. There we are. He also dibbles and dabbles in the odd seashell, by the way. But at the moment, they're struggling for supply. He is selling so many that there's a few little blank spots on this table. So if you want one of these, get down here very, very quick indeed. And also they're struggling to supply sharks. They're killing them and eating them so fast and the teeth are getting sold. And if you like a bit of shiver eye, well, well, it's there waiting especially for you. Thanks, Chris. I'll see you again Thank tomorrow. You. Thank yeah. you very, very much indeed. Ochin? Have I got a word? Can I say now? You can now. Okay. I think he swallowed the potiphon, yeah. the gramophone, the gramophone. or... Uh, uh, broken recorder. Yes. Broken recorder. Yes. If I only could say so many words in a minute, I would be somewhere else. Maybe. If only I could type, I'd make yes. a fortune. Yes. But by the way, uh, I'm only joking. Well done to you, good boy, blah, blah. But I, I was telling to Mr. Chris my situation. Uh, not long ago, before we go out, my I, I would like to say to the people, because they may write down what was it, why. Uh, the pulsation, without any reason, pulsation, pulse beating was crazy and uh, I didn't have any soil and I lied down and then after about 10 minutes, if you remember, Mr. Paul, I got better. And I was telling to Mr. Chris, and you know, you never know until you, I know, you will you say now you, had a, you should have uh, made the... Uh, blood pressure, took the results and blah blah, I know. But maybe you know why it's happening right I now. I know exactly why it happened. You lost one of your favourite earrings, you hunted for two hours, got excited, no, I don't think hyperventilated. So. No, I don't. Yes, I don't think, I think so. so. No, I wouldn't, I wouldn't worry about, on about any earring, uh, honestly, I wouldn't. But I was, no, I wouldn't. Yes, I was looking for it and really I was a bit upset where... <laughs> But uh, honestly, why did I have... It was a bit scary for me. I was collapsing. <laughs> right, come on. Don't upset Lord Julian because he gets very upset indeed if he knows we're off. The only person who gets happy is, of course, that Paul with a small P and an unbelievably small R. And one of these days, we'll bump into each other. That's for sure. Now, here we are. If you want to get a special, special gift, and we've got one commissioned as we speak, and if you want your name on a grain of rice, this is the place to come. There's all sorts of different ideas here. It can be on a pendant, it can be on a bracelet, it can be earrings, there we are. There could be a special, special pair waiting for Miss Ochin receiving our booth. So these are some of the ideas that Mr. Constantinos and his beautiful wife, Miss Katerina had come up with. And of course, one of these is waiting especially for you. They've also branched out into painting natural seashells. And of course, it could be one waiting there especially for you. That's his blonde beauty, Miss Katerina. And she's known as the greatest clefty, which means thief in Greek in the downtown Kedipapos Harbour area. And there's the man that does all the work. What does that say? Let's have a quick look. Can we see it? My goodness, it they says Max. Oh my goodness. That's the little gift for the little gangster boy known as Mr. Max. So we're going to pay this girl with some money and that'll put a smile on her face. And then we're going to go and take that and pop it in a little bag. And then, oh, there we are. You can see the booth is out his money now. See? It's, you know, his uh, reaction on... Far away, far away. His reaction on this is very good. He's got an as, allergic as, reaction to people taking his money. That's what it is. As soon as somebody's hand, whether it's my or Katerina, he's going immediately. Get away, get, get away. Get away, get away. There we are. Let's watch an artist at his craft. He's finished this little bracelet for our superstar. Beautiful. It's going to be bagged up. And we're going to say Faristo Pali. Thank you very much. Thank you very much, Constantinus. You are a star. Pop that in that bag. So now we've got the perfect present for Megan and the perfect present for the boy known as Gangster Max. 
and he's an absolute little superstar. Go hunting back where the kids and us went and got an ice cream for free off Mr. Marinos in the Jalalama restaurant. And uh, he enjoyed giving it, by the way, as well. I'm going to say thanks for watching. And of course, if you do like what you see, want to hit that like, click that subscribe, and come back for a little bit more of our madness. And you never know what you're at it. Perhaps you might want to hit the Buy Me A Coffee platform. Buy Me A Coffee, Marika and me, and perhaps treat us to a coffee or two. Do you know any word from this song? No. Let's go and have a look and get a bit closer to it. Over in the far end of the harbour is the Beer Fest. So that's a festival about beer. And of course they rank up that music and they serve you with beer and tempt you with all sorts of ideas. We'd love to go and film it, but of course if we do, we're going to get coffee strike after coffee strike. So it's literally impossible to film. And to be honest, it's unbelievably busy. Now, look at the beauty and the spectacality of the downtown Kedipapas Harbour. It's just over there, and guess what? It's waiting, especially for you. Let's get that big, big goodbye off the dancing girl known as Miss Arching Grassini out of the booth. Well, I'm really happy today because you are walking with us with great pleasure, always loving you. You never regret that one day you met us. Never, never, never. Because we will never regret and we are never regretting that we're meeting you again and again, thanking you from the bottom of our two hearts. She's dancing tonight, especially for you. We'll see you again very, very soon, somewhere along the downtown Kedipapos Promenade or in the harbour area. Thanks for watching.